Welcome everyone. In this video I'll be sharing a fascinating letter from one of the world's most famous scapegoats. His name is Zorlin and the letter was addressed to Sue Buchanan who was the founder of the Samui Times online news service. Okay, let's get straight into it. Dear Sister Sue, how are you today? I hope you are feeling well today. I received three very long letters from you at the same time and I also got the emails. I was surprised. I kindly thank you for taking the time to write to me. I think it is a very good news that someone wants to make a movie about your book and a lot more people will know me when it comes out to the public. And we just have to expect that someone will come forward to help me out of the prison. I was so happy to hear that Ian Yarwood is trying very hard to get me out of jail. Yeah, as you mentioned, he also has showed me what he is trying to get me out. He has sent a lot of letters to very important people for me, so it is great he is trying for me this way. Let's hope the important people would like to help me when they get his letters. Our room have now 22 people, so it is good, but sometimes they put about 24 people and it is a bit tight and not comfortable because you touch each other also are sleeping next off you and I have ever seen those people always have a problem and they have a fight because they woke up and cannot sleep again. This is normal problem in prison. The people in our room is okay and their behaviors is not so bad can forgive and understand each other. I see people in prison some are selfish and they don't care for others. I think they are angry all the time. Very sad that you had a problem with your gum. I hope the dentist can heal your problem and it will come back to normal. It is very important to take care of it. Here in the prison, a lot of people have no teeth and they are young, but no teeth. I think they used to smoke too much drugs when they stayed outside. A Thai man who share a table together with me only have three teeth in his mouth. He is a very funny guy. He said he want to eat an apple, but no teeth. I told him he can have some other fruit without apple, like banana, which he can chew, but he doesn't listen to me. And he say that he would like to have protein in his body. And he put the apple in a plastic bag and smash it to pieces and he swallow it. So it is very terrible to have no teeth. He said that it's one of big problems in his life after he can't eat an apple. So I take care of my teeth well because I don't want to be like him. You asked me which band I like to listen to. I like the German singer named Scorpion. I used to listen to his songs and I still love him. I also love the Myanmar singers named Lei Piu Gi, band I see. I can sing many of their songs. Can you send me one of Scorpion's songs, Always Somewhere, with chords? I think you know what I mean. Put the alphabet on the line so I know how to play. Sister Sue, please send my regards to my supporters. Also help me with financial. I do appreciate for their kindness. I wish I could see all of them in person one day when I come out. I just got a very long letter from you while I am writing this letter to you. I will answer you in a few weeks. I will write a letter to David Miller's mother and add it to your letter on the same envelope. Sister Sue, take good care of yourself. I thank you so much for everything. Sincerely yours, Zor Lin.